For several days now, we have been following developments with the remaining American Rescue Plan funds and whether the city of Buffalo plans to use them to fix budget gaps. But it took two on your side's Nate Benson a couple of days to be able to finally ask the ASCII mayor about it. He joins us now with the latest. Nate, what's going on? Yeah, Scott and Mary Alice, the acting mayor says that he met with the Fiscal Stability Authority earlier this week and talked about the idea of using $41 million from the rescue plan funds to fix the budget gap, but he says there's nothing set in stone yet. While handing out the turkey and fixins at the annual City Hall Thanksgiving dinner giveaway, I asked acting mayor Chris Ganlin the most direct question I could think of. Was there any consideration of doing a turkey drop like Cincinnati did in 1978 today? No, no WKRP stuff over here today, right? <sighs> Perhaps next year. I pulled the acting mayor aside after the event to try and get details about the city using the remaining rescue plan funds to fix budget gaps. There's no plan right now to do anything. And the acting mayor doesn't believe there is $41 million. I don't know how accurate that number is right now. We're working through that. According to the Buffalo Fiscal Stability Authority, as of November 1st, there was $41 million from the rescue plan that was still unobligated, meaning the contracts with the community groups that the money was promised to had not been finalized. So right now you don't know how much of that money is unobligated from the rescue plan? No, we're go I don't. right now we're trying to finalize exactly um, what's not been obligated. Um, what we might not be able to get out the door, quite frankly, if I'm being honest, mm -hmm. and we'll go from there. Meaning that he's not ruling out using those funds for the budget gaps. The city has to get that money out the door by the end of the year, otherwise they lose it. The city of Buffalo already used just shy of $160 million from the rescue plan for revenue replacements over the last three years, and that has drawn criticism from common council members, which we've documented. But now there's a new voice of criticism, someone who hasn't yet, but probably is on Saturday, announced his run for mayor in the Queen City, State Senator Sean Ryan. The city of Buffalo has been using a variety of gimmicks to plug their budget holes over the last several years. So using the American Rescue Plan last year to plug their budget hole and probably they're going to go to and get in uh, this year. You know, it, it just shows they, they don't really have a plan to get out of the mess that they've created uh, for themselves. Which is something you definitely say if you're not running for mayor, right? As for what's on the table for the acting mayor, Chris Ganlin, he already said there's no concrete plan for the rescue plan funds, but tax hikes, layoffs, and reduced spending are all on the table. As soon as we have some answers um, or some ideas on what we can do or need to do in order to make sure we don't lose this money, I can promise my colleagues in government they'll be hearing from me right away. So as it stands now, the city is considering using whatever funds are left. There's just no plan yet. On your side, Nate Benson, Channel 2 News.